My bestie from back home in Newcastle is visiting me for four days in London. <laughs> oh. Oh. Anastasia. <laughs> Yes, it's Tuesday. That means it's also pancake, pancake day. day. <laughs> we are currently hiking up Primrose Hill. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you cutie. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. It is Monday today and as you can see, my best friend Anastasia is still staying with me. If you haven't checked out part one, go back and check out my first part of the vlog. But for a little recap, my bestie from back home in Newcastle is visiting me for four days in London. Do you wanna say hi? Hi. Reintroduce yourself. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, yes it is morning. It is Monday morning, it is 9 a.m. And we are about to head out to a local bakery in my town to get I think croissants or something for breakfast. Yeah. Anything breakfast. Anything breakfasty. Uh, we're very excited. So, we're going to have a little slow stroll through. And then I'm thinking we might do Notting Hill today. Either Camden or Notting Hill, yes, we're going to see. Definitely. Because we love markets, we love colourful places. And I just think, yeah, I think you'd really enjoy yeah. it. And I really like the film as well. So, I want to see if that is like Notting Hill is like my shop. favourite film. Do, I, do you know my celebrity crush is Hugh Grant? <laughs> oh, no. He's got such a, like, a mental, like, like, his face is like a melted candle. Like, I just don't like. <laughs> He's got what? such a saggy face. This is such a strange old Sorry. to the vlog. <laughs> I just don't think he's an attractive person. I think oh, he's got no, a really saggy I face. I do quite fancy Hugh Grant. <laughs> anyway, on Sorry. that tangent, we are going to get our coats on and head out to get breakfast because I am feeling quite hungry, but that's just set the tone for the rest of this <laughs> vlog. A melted candle a melt face. <laughs> <laughs> We have secured the goods, so this is, I'll show yours, a hazelnut chocolate and custard croissant. I just think well, it looks it so it tasty. Look as nice as it is, but no, but it looks so delicious, yeah. doesn't it? Oh my goodness. I can't wait to dig into this. And classic cup of tea because we are we are very British. Are you excited for your croissant? Very excited. <laughs> we we did walk around all the bakeries in my area and landed on this. I've never seen anything like this before. I'm no, normally normally an almond croissant girl, but this is a bit different. Very excited. just been to Notting Hill. There's a dog running around. Sorry. Anastasia's getting very excited. We just walked along like Portobello Road Market. Obviously it's a Monday so it's a little bit quieter. There weren't as many stores as there would be on a Saturday but it was still just as nice. Yeah, really Got nice. our pictures by the colourful houses. Yes. Felt like we were in the film Notting Hill but no Hugh Grant in sight unfortunately. Thankfully. Um, and now we're just heading to Kensington Palace and walking through Kensington Gardens which is super pretty but I've never been here before so I'm kind of 
kind of aimlessly walking us through and hoping we're gonna find She's a great guide, something. Okay. I feel like I'm not doing that great of a job. I'm kind of just like, walk and see, walk and see. But I guess they're kind of the best sort of days where you just walk and get somewhere that you didn't plan to get to. So yeah. we'll see what we find. Definitely. But it's very chill, nice and relaxed. And then maybe we'll find somewhere to have a spot of lunch. The dogs oh, the great. dogs look so <laughs> cute. lots of dogs at the moment. Lots of dogs. <laughs> Hello. day it has turned out to be we are back in the house now from our little day trip out we obviously went to Notting Hill and walked along Portobello Road Market which as I've said was a lot quieter than it would be on the weekend but it was really nice because you could walk it really slowly and not feel like you were getting pushed about everywhere and like getting in people's ways trying to stop and take photographs and yeah it just wasn't a stressful frustrating situation as it would have been if we'd gone on one of the more busier peak days and then we wandered up to Kensington Gardens and Kensington Palace which was lovely but unfortunately it was closed I think they are setting up an exhibition or something at the moment so walked along there and then up to Hyde Park and then we just started to feel a bit tired and drained I think from all the fresh air so we decided to hop on the bus back to where I'm from and good job we did because it's so much warmer here like the sun is out it's a lot warmer it's a lot nicer the wind has dropped here so i'm glad we did come back we got some lunch at one of my favorite cafes in my little town village sort of area and i went for the halloumi mediterranean vegetables brioche roll with beetroot hummus it had like courgettes and mushrooms and onions in it as well and peppers it was very very tasty with the halloumi it was it was a good balance of like the saltiness and the like sweetness of the vegetables I guess you could say. I think Anastasia went for like a coronation chicken style one which was good and now yeah we've just decided to pop in. I guess we kind of want to recuperate. The whole point of this trip is to enjoy each other's company. As she said like she's here to visit me not see London. She's seen touristy London. We just want to spend quality friend time together and we've decided to come back and I think we're going to film a YouTube video for you guys so looking forward to doing that and stopping for a tea break. I am in desperate need for a cup of tea. And then I think tonight we'll probably just have a nice dinner out because we haven't done a dinner out yet. We did take away pizza obviously last night. We've done a couple of like lunches out and things but we'd like quite a nice dinner. I'm not sure what we're going to do between filming the YouTube video and, and dinner though. Maybe we'll head back out for a slow stroll or we'll just stay in and chat and catch up but that's the blessing of it all because we're just taking it slow and doing what we feel like doing and that means it's been more enjoyable I think for the both of us because I don't have the stress of navigating around London like a tour guide and Anastasia doesn't have the stress of like running all over London and tiring herself out as well. We're both enjoying like well this is her half term and my annual leave so yeah 
enjoying the time together because we haven't had this in a very, very long time and she's my bestie and I love her to bits and I love spending time with her. Sorry. <laughs> no, it looks lovely. It looks really nice. We are back in and we're just getting ready for bed, in for the evening. I think we're going to watch Notting Hill tonight because yeah. we've talked about Hugh Grant so much today <laughs> and we went to Notting Hill. Yeah. So it's got to be done. We went to a lovely pizza restaurant in yeah. my neighbourhood. The same place we ordered takeaway pizza from last night. Yeah. But the vibe, really the vibe inside is just so good. I ge genuinely think it's my favourite restaurant I've ever been to. It's so cosy. The lighting is perfect. Fairy lights. It's mm. just really good like authentic italian feel i think it's a family business yeah it was just it was really it nice was really warm. It? and you can see the pizza oven as well yeah you can really see nice. the pizza oven from where we were sat we decided to go for pasta because obviously we went for pizza last night mm -hmm. i went for the truffle mushroom and parmesan cheese i went for risotto mm. not even pasta yeah you, that's yeah. true you did what, what was your risotto was it mushroom it's like a mushroomy one it was we really both nice. went mushroom it was so so good very creamy and rich yeah. i was determined to finish it because it just, it was the best pasta I've ever tasted. I actually couldn't finish mine. It yeah. was like, it was so good. But, but it was so I good. Just, you, know, you know, and you need to like stop when you know like. Yeah, you don't want to push too far because yeah. then it's, you're not going to enjoy it anymore. Yeah. Whereas I was determined to, to get that last <laughs> bit of ravioli. That's how I got not, not pasta, ravioli. And I just, mm, so good. But that is us for the night. I'm going to get into my pajimmy jammies. You've already got yours on. You're yeah, on it. Mine on. And climb into bed. It's all cosy over here. Got my fairy lights on and film night and then last day got my world. chocolate buttons for it oh yeah anastasia went to the shop to get her chocolate buttons so film night we should have got popcorn mm. but then again after that dinner i feel a bit before bit, you go to bed yeah mm. i don't want popcorn crumbs in my bed mm. no 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 but thanks for watching again and i'll see you in the morning happy tuesday today is our last day together on our emma and anastasia take london adventures i can't believe how quickly that's gone it's gone so quick it's gone so fast we've really quick. we've done so much but it's not felt rushed no. at all no. but it feels like we've covered a lot of ground but also yeah. had a lot of downtime like this morning we just sat in bed scrolling through tiktok and instagram <laughs> yeah. reels for a couple of hours like oh look at this and then like scroll some more oh this is you and like it was just really nice like we never get time no. to do that together so that's been our morning yes it's tuesday that means it's also pancake, pancake day, day or shrove tuesday whatever you call it so we're going to try and head out and get some pancakes in london mm -hmm. yum, yum, yum. but i do worry about what the queues are going to look like we were thinking where the pancakes are which is a very famous restaurant in mm -hmm. london so i do worry it's going to be super busy they weren't taking bookings today because it's pancake day but they do have extended opening hours i think from 7 a.m till yeah. 10 p.m which is a bit insane That's a long but i'm day. very ready for some tasty pancakes so am I. what would you go what's your go-to pancake choice um well toppings wise nutella mm, and classic. strawberries and banana I yeah just, that's your that's favorite like combo my favorite combination so i think for me i'm well i'm more of a crepe kind of gal yeah than, a, than an american style pancake i do like like mixed fruits like berries with ice cream i also you know what i really love lemon and sugar i just don't think you can go wrong with it uh, i know it's really basic and a lot of people just <laughs> would be like no what you're talking like about my least i do favorite. like it um maple syrup's always a shout but it's not something i would go for nutella i can kind of pass on it's not the biggest thing for me although i do like nutella and bananas yeah this is just all oh, cream i like cream oh well. yeah a bit of like, like a little bit of squid mm, it's quite cream mine, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna go and see what toppings they do and if we can actually get a seat if if not there are so many cafes in london so yeah. many places we could walk to and try and get some pancakes i'm yeah. sure and then i think maybe a slow stroll to camden like along camden lock maybe mm -hmm. it's not part of london i know that well so we can explore, explore it together. and uncover it together and that is the day and then You'll be back off to Newcastle. Then I'll be off home. But it's been lovely having you. Thank you. <laughs> I've loved being here. Oh, sweet pie. But we're <laughs> going to crack on because we want to make the most of this last day together.
We are currently hiking up Primrose Hill. So if we sound a little bit out of breath, it's because we are, we are walking uphill. We had our pancakes this morning for pancake day. Yeah. Uh, they were so good. We went for savory pancakes in the end. Yeah. I was a little bit disappointed because I really wanted like strawberries or raspberries with cream or ice cream and they weren't doing that. So I did go for the savory vegan option and they were so tasty. It had avocado, chickpeas, and this really tasty dressing. And then you. Like an eggs benedict, the eggs benedict kind of like yeah. thing with bacon and avocado, which I really liked. So that's yeah. what I wanted to have, so I was pretty pleased. Yeah, and then we headed to Camden Town, walked around Camden, and now we're up on Primrose Hill to see the view. <laughs> that is a very foggy day, so I'm not sure we can see oh, all that really. much, but it's not too bad. We'll see when we're at the top. Which one do you think is my comment? Do you, do you think you can work it out? <laughs> okay, let me check. I know you had writing well. Yeah. It's, it's in my favourite colour, if that helps. Yeah, okay. It's one from the <laughs> It is, actually! <laughs> How did you guess that on a wall this big? Uh -oh. Yeah. <laughs> that was so good. God, you really do I know me well. <laughs> And that's our weekend trip done. Anastasia's on the floor packing up a suitcase, her coat's on, she's about to put her shoes on. Don't go! Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Don't go! No, I'm actually so sad for you to leave. We've had the best weekend ever. <laughs> oh, you, you We had the best weekend ever. Yeah, we did. We had a really good one. I'm so sad to see you go, but so glad we finally had a trip together, made some memories together, had some chill time together, because we've yeah. never done that in a long time, other than like sitting and chatting. But yeah. this has been like chill, chill. doing things things together because i feel like when you have a your home like we're trying to make the most of that time yeah but is this we're like we've got our time we're already together there's no like yeah how have you found yeah, it pressure. how would you sum it up in one word there's not a lot of pressure one on camera word. can we do three <laughs> okay go on okay chill yeah that's the buzzword of this trip fun yeah it was fun and just lovely oh like, just, yeah. lovely. Just, just lovely i'd say memorable yeah, yeah. Lots this of one's, memories made. Yeah, it's nice. We never get pictures together. We've got pictures <laughs> yeah. and videos. So. Got, we need to get a picture because yeah. we never get them. Because you never get because we're always just enjoying the moment. But this yeah. time we've made sure to document still it. Still enjoyed the moment. Still enjoyed like, the moment. Yeah. Photos of them but thank well. you so much for coming all this way. Oh, I just genuinely you. had the best time ever. I don't want you to go. I don't want to go. I hope you guys have enjoyed following our little extended weekend together in part one and part two. Let me know in the comments below if there were any standouts for you, any highlights, any places we went to that you guys want to go to or you would bring your friends to. I'd love to hear it. And thanks as ever for watching everybody. See you later. Bye.